Hey. Hey, so welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Jasmine McKenna. And this video I wanted to, you know, sit down face to face and talk about summer trends. 2024 summer trends. I've been seeing some videos go around. I'm a little late. But whatever. Summer just started. And I think I can still put this out there if I want to. Period. <laughs> I want to talk about trends that I have been seeing that are definitely going to happen this summer are happening. Trends I would like to see more of this summer. Trends I honestly don't even like. So, you know, we may agree, we may disagree. And, you know, I may miss some. So we're going to start top to bottom. So I'm going to start with tops. The tops, I don't have a lot. There's not many that I'm like seeing it over. Okay, soccer jerseys. I'm obsessed with this trend. I know it's not really a new, new trend, but I am seeing the girls styling it in like so many different cool ways now. I like like the tight fit, like the tight like woman's fit. So cute. But now I'm, I'm starting to like like the baggier, bigger fit. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. I did get a soccer jersey, a tight fit one, because I did see it styled with like lace. I got this woman's cut soccer jersey. So cute, I love her. I got it on Depop. Then I was like, okay, I kinda wanna wear it with like lace underneath, but I want like to have like lace capris. So I bought a bodysuit on Amazon. It was like, it, it's a full bodysuit, so it's like it's got legs. So I'm just gonna like cut it and then wear it with like kitten heels. It's so like this on top of this. I think it would be cute. Then the next top that I'm loving is like the dainty crop tank tops, but they have like cute like ruffle details, playing with like mix and match like textures, fabrics, whatever, prints. Um, but you know, like in like the spaghetti strap, like so cute for the summer. And like, I've been seeing it at first a lot in white, but now I am seeing it in like different colors, which again, I don't like, this isn't really like a new big trend, nothing crazy new. Just what I feel like I'm seeing more of that I love. And I actually do have a top. She's almost worn out. So cute. She's from Zara. The only thing is like, you have to like tie her in the back and I don't really have anybody who can tie this tight for me in the back so I do feel a little insecure but still really cute with like a white maxi skirt with jeans shorts like whatever but yeah that's honestly it for tops sorry sorry I'm keeping it simple with my crop tops t-shirts this summer I think yeah Okay, so next we'll get into bottoms. First, I'm gonna start with the love of my life, capris. I love capris and I, for work, I do interviews, like street interviews, asking people about like different summer trends, fall trends, icks in fashion, blah, blah, blah. And like, I'll ask them if they like capris, a lot of them, no, it's a nay for them. No, 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 which is so sad. Cause I love capris, I like them in like denim woven fabrics, crochet, oh my God. Like, I have a pair. I have two pairs actually, both in denim. I love like the cargo, like loose, looser fit and like a canvas fabric. So cute, like you can dress it up, you can dress it down. Very wide 2K, love it, love it. Next, we have mini skirts. Mini skirts is a yay for me, but I feel like when I wear mini skirts, it just, I don't know, I just don't look super cute in them, but I want to, and I'm trying real hard to like, like wrap my head around it because I've been seeing some mini skirts on like Depop, those like Y2K, 2000s, like 90s, cool, like detailed. That's what I love, that's what I want, but I can never find my size on Depop. And if I do, it's like 300, and fifty dollars and ninety eight cents. I don't got that. Still love it though. Still trying. Still trying. So next we have maxi skirts. 
I really like flowy maxi skirts for the summer. I have like a white one. I have two white ones actually. I do have like this black denim maxi skirt with like white top sh stitching and like cool belt loops. It's, you know, stylish. She's, she's that girl. But I don't know, it is a little tight and I don't know if I like that for the summer. I'm more into like the flowy, airy, you know, let it, you know, you know, breathe, you know. You know, some of these girls, like that court core maxi, the, ugh, I guess that's more midi, whatever, midi maxi skirt like that, chef's kiss. But I don't know, that's more like fall, I guess, right? But that's really, really cute. I love that. But again, I don't know if it really flatters me, but I do like to see it. I do like to see the girls. Okay, I am so excited for cheeky shorts, micro shorts. I am going to Martha's Vineyard in Spain this summer. <laughs> no biggie. Y'all, I'm so excited. But I got some cute bikinis that I'm trying to, you know, strut in. But I like to wear my bikinis with like shorts, a cute like cover up. So I really want to get some like cute cheeky shorts again though on like Depop, Y2K, cool 90s style cheeky micro shorts. That's what I want, that's what I need. Something that I have seen and I know is a trend, but I don't think I will be partaking in is bloomers. I have seen so many girls look so cute and like gorgeous in them, but I just know if I put it on, I'm gonna be the one to look like I'm wearing a diaper. And I, I can, I can, again, 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 again. I see them all the time and like, I've thought about it. Maybe I just need to try a pair on and then decide. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. But no, I'm not really loving it for me. But on the girls, yes. Something I am into, sweat shorts. Yeah, sweat shorts, so cute. Like the pair I'm wearing, they're from Aritzia. My grandfather gave me money and I was like, you know, I wanna splurge. So I got overpriced sweat shorts from Aritzia, but these shorts feel so good, so comfy. I'm about to get the matching sweatshirt so cute i think inya had it on with like a trench coat i don't know if she was wearing the hoodie or like a crew neck or something cute like you can dress it up you can dress it down like ooh, i love it next is jorts yes 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 i love jorts i have a few pair of jorts just had on a pair yesterday might wear them tomorrow. They just look so cool, like relaxed. You know, they get that skater feel. I wonder how skater people feel about that though. I mean, like, you can't wear jorts. You're not a skater. I don't know. I might be making up fake beef. Yeah, I like jorts. They're cute. I'm with it. Next is barrel jeans. First I was like, yes. Then I was like, no. Then I was like, yes again. And now I'm like, I don't know. First I was like, yes, because I saw like Gen Z girlies wearing it and like they styled it so cute, loved it. Then I started seeing like millennials wearing it, like from free people. And I was like, mm, 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 mm. Then I saw it again, like they're, you know, picking back up again. Like I've seen, I'm seeing it styled cooler now, I guess. Then I thought to try on a pair, then I saw like one picture of someone wearing bare jeans, which I'm not showing. I was like, uh-uh, uh-uh, I can't do it. So I don't think it's gonna look good on me. I'm gonna look bow-legged. <sighs> Sorry. But I don't know, they look so cool on some people. They do, but I, it's not for me, not for me. Last is, I have written down like 2000s Y2K jeans, which I know I've been like preaching Y2K, throughout this video but those like slubby like cool crazy details like cool trims th like in 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 oop, oop. interesting thread color like like baby fat like it's like a really good one with like the slubby fabrics and like those like fur trims like miss 60s like oh so good so good so good so good you know those like older like what you find on like poshmark depop Etsy, those type, like, I want like a good pair. So next we get into dresses. I love slip dresses. I've always been a slip dress girl. I recently bought like this floral slip dress. 
this blue one it was a little too tight and i cut it up turned it into something else i just really like slip dresses and like i really like the like silk ones or like the chiffon ones and when they like mix and match prints so cute last is like a staple white dress i have a few white dresses i just don't know if it's like my staple dress for the summer or even like a staple white set like a top like a skirt again for my trip to spain like a white dress would eat down right and next we got shoes i have been wearing these for over a year now but toe sneakers my nike rift toe sneakers i die behind those oh my god i love those sneakers so much and every time i wear them people are like that's weird that's cool and then and then they ask like does it feel weird no it doesn't i like the space in between my toe and then they ask me like where my toes are and i'm like ooh, what you want to know about my feet for hmm at the feet but yeah, I like them, they're cute. I just think, I wanna get more colors, different pairs, but they're so expensive. I think we got mine for $50. Next are orchid heels. Oh my God, or like the little flowers on the heels. So cute, I just got some. I got some pink ones, they're real cheapy. Don't even ask me where they're from. Don't worry about it. To go with like this dress that I may or may not wear them with, but they're so cute and like, I just can't spend the money on the ones I want. I need. I love the way the girls are styling them. I think everyone needs a pair. Okay, okay. Last is flats. Again, flats have been a thing, but I don't know if it's just me, but I'm getting into flats now. Flats, girl, down. Hold on. Let me show you something. I got these from Crossroads in the East Village. Katy Berry, or they're fuzzy, so cute. Like, I don't know, I just like, I was like, I can do something with these, I can eat with these. I don't know, I don't know, yes, yes, no, I don't know. Next we have, I call this category miscellaneous, because it, it, they could fit in any of these other categories, I guess. So the first one is leopard print. I love leopard print on denim, non-denim, whatever the frick, fur, so cute. I love that it's coming in. We need to bust out the leopards. Silk prints, chiffon prints, bust it out, bust it out, bust it out, bust it out, bust it out. Next is the bubble skirt or bubble dress. Now, I have been partaking. I know there is kind of a love-hate for this trend. I honestly love it. I actually bought a shirt from Zara. It was a bubble shirt that I thought was a skirt. So I've been wearing it as a skirt. Still cute, so eats. And I have this one, this plaid one. People love it on the Tiki Tok. And yeah, I'm gonna wear that till the day I die because it's so cute and fun. Next is like, I don't know, maybe I'm trying to force this. Maybe it is a thing and I just didn't know it. I only have like a few images, but like stacked bikinis. So cute, like Tyler had that on she like three bikinis i thought that was so cute and like i can't find any other girls doing like stacked bikinis but like bikinis with like a tank so you see the two straps i don't know that's really cute we might be doing that in martha's vineyard in spain mm -hmm. last we have accessories i recently made a tiktok decorating my mew mew or as i would like to call it few few because i got that girl on the yellow app shh, 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 shh. Yeah, the bag's fake, whatever. Is this not cute? Tamagotchi, like, yes. That's my girl, that's my girl. I encourage everyone to do that. I know this is not a new thing as well. I think this has been a thing for a long, long while, but I've been seeing it on like the Mew Mew bag. Let me copy, let me steal, whatever. I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. Inspo, inspo, so yeah. Bust it out. Put it on any bag. Your Nine West. Put it on your Nine West bag. I got a Nine West bag. I'm about to do do that to her too. Mm -hmm. That eats. That eats. Stacked jewelry. Ugh. Live and die by it. I need to get like real gold though or real silver because my neck the irritation I can't handle. Last is chunky earrings. Chunky earrings. I love them. I love them. I've always been a chunky earring girl or like big hoop girl. I love it. It's so cute. Or like like a simple outfit with like a big old like statement earring to die for. I actually have these 
fake Bottega dupes that everyone loves. I love your earrings. I'm like, thank you. I got them for like $8 in like jewelry district in Manhattan at some random shop. Big old store with like all kinds of dupes, mind you. If you are sensitive, put nail polish on the whatever, let it dry, and stick them in. It's a little secret, I got you, I got you. Anyway, that was it for the video. I don't know, you guys let me know what you think. Do you agree with these trends? Did I miss any? Were there any that you hated? You hate? I don't know. Let me know. I'm glad I got to, you know, yap at you. This was fun. More videos to come. Hey, I'm being consistent. Yeah. Love you guys so much. Peace and hair grease.